Don't mind me one little bit. I like how the slimes don't have proper animation to fall down. What, are you special slime? No, this is me going back. Hello, default uh, jumping animation. Oh no, she got me. Hopefully her boyfriend is very proud of her. And I like how the enemies randomly just throw, sim throw themselves off the ledge. The frame rate started dropping because there are too many enemies following me. What are you guys eating? Frame rates? Yeah, I too would eat frame rates if, like, the game is dropping frame rates because there are too many enemies following me at the same... <laughs> Say what you will about Capcom and From Software. I think Capcom does this, like, when there is too many things. Say what you will about at least Capcom. Because I know Capcom, like, drops the frame rate on stuff. When there's, like, a lot of things going on. I think they do that. Oh, I wish I had my gun here. Oh yeah, wait, I... <laughs> well, joke's so new, I don't care about the invasions. Ladies, take it easy. Also, I need a dog tag to open a door? This is new? No! What? I swear I didn't run there on purpose. I don't know why my character did does this thing. You, you can sometimes see like I change direction and then I try to run in a different direction. My character does like a deja vu slide for a little bit. Wow, Carmilla. Oh, Skyrim voice actor, hi! <laughs> Undamaged paint set. Well, you know, considering all the characters have the mental capacity of a five-year-old. Bitch, I'm going out on my own terms. Um, I can't go out on my own terms. Okay. Oh, right, I forgot you can't, you can't fall off the ledge unless if you're dodging. Uh, you look unique. Why are you unique? Okay, never mind. Hello, loser. Can I backstab you or... Because you're a boss, you can't be backstab. Backstab? Um, I'm sorry, what is that? Backstab? So, because you're a boss, I can't backstab you. I got this. Cheater? No, I don't think I can run from that one. Okay. You even have an explosion on that? Uh, you don't even have an attack frame there. Yeah, I don't think you can dodge him because of that one very specific attack. Uh, 
we started again. Having to run all the way back there. And there are no enemies in front of me, so you know, I don't know what that accomplishes. Okay, I don't know why they have to put an enemy with a gun. Can you just let the player have fun game, or is that too much to ask for? Okay, that one... Okay, that one, if you're near, it misses. Okay, should I be running to your left, maybe? Well, not to your left, to my left. Well, unless you do that attack, of course, this is a whole different story. Thank you, Windows, for telling me I've updated the middle of combat. No, that is almost impossible. Or maybe if I stay close to him. Well, you see, if you're a fair boss, you'd let the player heal once a year, maybe. Yeah, that has almost one-to-one -one tracking. Look at this cheater tracking the player all over the place. Oh, oh my god, that's outside of the hitbox. Uh, we started. I, I, I like how when these videos go up, I don't know when they're gonna go up. I've almost like an entire, entire year of videos. If I release a video every day, I literally have like 365 videos. That's not even a joke. There's like an entire year of video backlogs that I recently uploaded. So whenever these videos go up, man, like they are so... I think like if the video is about two hours long. Uh, one hour of that is just me like literally slowing down and zooming in and showing like an entire body size of hitbox away from me getting hit by something that's not over there. Huh? That was a hitbox, sir? Okay, no, the weapon does have a hitbox on the... on that attack. What is that? Oh, he's powering up. Huh? Okay. Um, okay. Okay, there's a distance to that. Okay. Um, does a player not have time to... I'm sorry, when am I supposed to attack during this phase? And most importantly, does the player not have time to heal either? You know, I'm just gonna say one thing. If, um, uh, this is related to Elden Ring. I don't know anything about Elden Ring. I didn't play it, but... Um, if Elden Ring is, like, not even close to being this difficult, I'm gonna be very surprised at all the people that complain about it. Uh, which attack was that? Yeah, I, I keep forgetting, like, that one. Look at him do a double track on the player over there. What a load of horse shit. Okay. Um. Yeah, 
Is it him like going super aggro on the player? And you have to like wait it out before you can re-engage with him? Uh, okay. W what was that lingering hit? Oh no, 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 no. That is unfair. First of all, A, that hitbox was way too big. You could literally see it miss my character and yet it technically hit them for some reason. That hitbox was way too big for that attack. Also, it hit me like I think a second later after the dodge. Oh yeah, why did I lock on to him? Yeah, yeah, I need the accurate hitboxes, don't I? Oh my god, get out the wall. Yeah, hi. Oh, okay. He he's he's he like he like goes super aggro during that time. Okay. Um. So there's no way to like no no dodge this. I I think you're forced to dodge over there. Uh, but man, my stamina is like dying over there. What can I do about that? If my stamina was like just even twenty five percent faster, this would be so much more comfortable. Oh, the hitbox on that starts a lot earlier than expected. Dodge into him then? To buy myself the space? Okay, there we go. Oh, oh, he's, he's not aggro anymore? Oh, okay. Oh, no, now, now he's re-aggroed. Okay, so in this phase, I have to lock on. Yeah, I shouldn't be r rolling those early at all. The problem is Code Vein teaches you, teaches you to dodge early in order to, like, start getting your iframes. The iframes don't come out when you first dodge. There's a slight delay on the dodge. It's not like Dark Souls, so basically in Dark Souls, when you dodge, I don't know if, um... When you press dodge... Uh, because this sometimes happens, like, for example, you're attacking and your character is, like, in the middle of an attack animation. If you perfect time your dodge, you'll sometimes notice, like, this weird thing where the enemy is hitting you, like, you're... you're like, you can see your character getting hit visually, but they don't take any damage and they roll. That is because you perfect dodge during the last point of the animation frame. Dark Souls is always like that. That is why you're rolling, you get hit. At the start, there's like this weird thing. Sometimes don't... Oh, my buff is going down. Hold on, let me let me try to take on this guy first. Oh, I thought you were gonna buff! Okay, there we go. You're in the middle of an attack animation, especially something with long recovery. Sometimes you'll notice this weird thing, like... You're still hitting an enemy or you're completing your animation and you don't take any damage and then you melee dodge. That is because there's like a 10% thing, like, you know, that, that break point of the iframe starting up and the and the animation finishing. So when you press the dodge, you you it looks like you're like you're getting hit, but you're essentially in iframes. So I I don't know why they changed it for this boss specifically. I don't know why it's starting off later rather than earlier on. This one always dodge. This one is an explosion. Does that always travel? Oh, yeah, he snaps on that one. This one has range. Okay, the, yeah, don't travel on that one. So you travel on the other one? Do that again? Can you do that other attack again? 
Yo, homie. Yeah, he double snaps on that one. Why? Okay, just kill me then. Oh my god, I think they didn't know how to use... I don't think they knew how to blend the two animation states together. But but you can blend the animation states in, in Unreal Engine. Why? He literally does one track to player known position and then he does another one and the animations don't blend. Are you gonna transform now? No, that's one of the transform state, never mind. <laughs> that's a lingering head fox, really? Okay, you should transform by now. There we go! Two dodges? Not even two dodges is enough for that? Three. I'm out of stamina. Uh, yeah, thank you for... Okay, fine. Uh, hey, you didn't track me there. What happened? What? You became fair again? So... Uh, do you take more damage during the buff now? No, always during the buff animation. It doesn't take any extra damage. Okay, where was the first attack on that one, Cholo? No, I should never be locking on during this phase. Sir, please, my steamies. You know, for a lot of anime, I seem to have a lot of lacking steamies. Can you get out the wall, please? Uh, bitch, this is not Dark Souls. Oh, you're buffing, never mind. I literally couldn't see you there! Can my stamina please regen by the end of the year? Okay. Why sometimes two is enough and other times not? No, I shouldn't be healing. Oh. And... <laughs> Thank you for using that attack when I don't have stamina, bitch. There's something weird, whenever I press, like, when I stop moving and then I press forward slightly, I break his travel time. Okay, I should dodge into him. No matter what, when I'm walking towards him. Okay, you did a third this one? Okay, there we go. And... That last no player position is so janky. It, it, that, that is constantly breaking half of the time. W whenever I press backwards forwards, he gets into me, he stutters. And then I don't know why that's such a difficult time blending animations. Because in the Unreal Engine, blending animation is just like connecting nodes, literally. Like there's a reason why students use Unreal and Unity.
Well, Unreal mostly is easier. It's like literally just connecting boxes together. I don't know how they screwed up the last known player no position track. Why do you have a hole in your chest? Man, my minimap has seen better days. I'm excusing, bitch. I don't need to fight you. Uh, do you drop anything? What you call for kicking me for? Can I backstab you unlike your boss? Employee of the fucking year here. Of course, you can backstab this guy, but not the boss. Also, frankly speaking, uh, fuck your, you know, pimp chain. I don't know why these guys' coat have like a pimp chain on it, just like around their neck. Did someone forget to light on the candle? <laughs> why is that? Hold on, are these running on candles? I never stopped to ask that question, are these things running on candles? Who goes around every day refilling them up with candles or wax or oil? The, the real heroes are the revenants. There, there is a... They, I, you know what? I'm actually more interested right now in the story of someone in the background that goes around in this entire world every day refilling up those lanterns. That's the entire lore. There's someone out there refilling those things. I'm, I'm so invested right now in the lore of these lanterns. Oh no, the worst area in the entire game. Bitch, what did I just say? <laughs> Wait, I can't go in there? Okay, very well understood. Have a good day. Fuck you too. How about that, huh? Uh, where did that fire just... What the skies... <laughs> where? Where are those fires coming from even? Just, they're just spawning in the air. God, these vampires suck. They can't jump, they can't fly. Oh yeah, these explode or something. Okay, bitch, I learned my lesson. Don't fight anyone, just... Woman, go up ladder! What, it's hot? What, are you afraid of burning yourself? Step booster. Don't talk about your brother like that. Is this important? No. You can't walk anymore? Bitch, are you seeing my situation? I'm walking on fire. Like once you hit the castle, unless you're upgrading. Did that monkey seriously do what I think it just did? Bitch, are you for real? Uh, are you for real? No, that's not the buff I wanted. Okay, fine. No, no, I don't, I don't need the hammer guy. I just want on principle. I need to teach that monkey a lesson. There! You are a dirty. Can I drop from here? What's over here? That monkey running up to me with his big ass sword and he thinks it's hot shit, literally. Uh, why well, don't you want to drop down? Oh yeah, I need to take one step down before dropping down. Okay, Superman, get out of my way. A bitch, are you happy? We're all gonna die today! Global warming, not even once. Oh, anything in here? Did you just throw a knife at me to stagger me to the fire? Good for you! You should join a pro team, motherfucker! Uh, okay. No, you don't wanna jump this, huh? You don't wanna jump this. You don't want to jump this, huh? You don't want to jump this! You don't want to go up there! What a terrible place. <laughs> See the way the queen? It's just absurd. See the way the queen? It's just Yeah, 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 20 minutes of lore! 20 minutes of lore! Stop picking up items, honestly. Yeah, stupid monkeys, they can't climb ladders. 
Opposable thumbs, bitch. Oh, wait, they don't have opposable thumbs. Lack, lack of tail? Everybody knows uh, human's greatest strength is lack of tail. We have excellent balance thanks to that. No! Oh, uh, bitch! Ow! Motherfucker, you baited me. I hurt myself. What, you're sleeping under the tiny ass car? Uh, by the way, my character is a shorter size and she's still bigger than a car. What happened to the society? Whatever cataclysm happened, everything shrunk in size. It's like when you wash your clothes on the wrong uh, options. Fireproof tonic. Thank you for much. Oh my god. Ah, I'm gonna die with these cutscenes. I like the lore over here. It says if you take a charge booster, it becomes less effective over time. The joke is that's that's not at all what this that's not at all what happens. There's nothing like that. Oh, don't pretend you're sleeping down there. That lost guy down there is like I'm gonna pretend I'm sleeping so I can catch a random person that may may one day pass here by accident. Fuck off, Vader! Yep, that's how lightning works. It travels by ground. Oh, please. As if you're any stronger than your boss. I mean... Bitch, are you for real? Don't! Don't disturb me while I'm fighting. Did you drop anything? No. I like to imagine if you go on the weekend, check it out. This guy has like a 1% chance of dropping titanium. Wake up! What are you pretending to do? Did you seriously? You guys seriously came down here and are pretending to sleep in all this fire? <laughs> I mean, you, okay, what the fuck were you guys even doing with your lives, honestly? Okay, so two Queen Titanium. It seems like every time you go into a new area, if there's at least one great upgrade, bitch, I just hurt myself because you, you scared me. It's the activator. Haha, <laughs> bitch, I got this, whatever this is. Man. <laughs> don't. Whatever you plan. You know, I, I don't know how ma- Goddamn tactical! What? What's the Latin word for monkeys? Tactical apes? No, that's not Latin. I like how this metal is burning here. I mean, in, in the guess, I guess metal can melt. It jokes have meaning. <laughs> do, do they? <laughs> ah! That joke here is out of fuck did it get up here? Wait, are you two new monkeys? I mean, God forbid you throw a cup of water here. How How is this place even burning, honestly, for so long? Mind affects stamina, drain speed, and light gifts. When you say stamina, what do you mean by stamina? Like two points. Don't lie to me, game effect stamina. Camouflage. Does it say how long it is? You know what? Yeah. What? <laughs> game, why do you emit it? Game, just go to the maximum amount I can buy. Don't grieve me like this. Labyrinthine halls of this holy place called the Lost Lambs who end up wandering them forever. So, what came first? The lore about getting lost in the cathedral or. The castle first and then the lore, so the developers have an excuse to defend themselves with. D is that how long it is? About 20 seconds? Well, I mean, once you see me, it doesn't really matter now, does it? Is it gonna fall me? Please don't fall me. Noble Silver. How hey, loser. Honestly, frankly speaking, fuck you, buddy. 
buddy, where are you going? Okay, yeah, stay right there. Think about what you did. Yep, just kick that ladder. It's not like you can jump, grab onto it, and pull it down. Ah, Santa Maria. Okay, so where's Sartal? But no, that's not at all what I wanted to do, but okay, you know. What is... Where is it? Is that how many parts there are to this? Scatach? Let me Google this. Cold veins, Scatach. How many different parts are there? One, one, wait. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, has five vestige fragments and four completed cores. Um, okay, where's the cores? Are these the cores? So, one, two, three, four. Okay, so these are parts. These are cores. One, two, three, four. So, four complete cores. So, I did get them all, I think. This is based upon me trying to figure out what the wiki is saying. Because they're not called cores. You could just, you know, these are parts. And then these are the vestiges by themselves. Just, that's what you need to call them. And just say there's like four... God, this menu is so messy. Okay, Jiggly. Okay, still with the... Well, not one-to-one -one tracking, actually. Just for the player, one-to-one. -one. <sighs> I'm gonna have to be honest. I really think, like, stamina is no place in this game. They really want you to play as if you can hit the enemy once or twice. So, I think I might have needed to upgrade, um, like, the machete instead. I think the machete would have been much, much better as a weapon. Or the broadsword. The broadsword is slightly faster. The broadsword is 0.05 milliseconds faster than this one. I think this one is, like, um, this one is 40. 40 milliseconds to complete the animation attack. This one is 35, if I recall correctly, on my videos. Okay, you do have something for your back. Uh, your tail. Left side? I think left side? By the way, what moveset does a machete have? Yeah, it's slightly too long, unfortunately. So I think I can only hit her once. God, the, these, these bosses really don't want to let me hit them. Yeah, I, I need to like almost go just... Well, unless she's too far away. I think I need to go completely to the left at that point. Not even diagonal. Like, every other boss dodges. She's she's the first boss that doesn't dodge. She just moves around really... Flexibly, for the sake of horny. Maybe just don't run. Well, unless she does that, of course. Oh man, that's a lot of horse- Man, these staggers also have no place in the game. The game is way too fast action for staggers like this. 
Yeah, that'll track me no matter what. She hits me, but she's not supposed to hit me. And then she actually does hit me. So she is supposed to hit me. I, I think I think if I just get her into harsh rotations, she won't be able to hit me. Something like that. Just skip to her left, I guess? But no, she also starts to tail from her left. What is this horse shit, honestly? Okay, so going to our left is the safest because I think our fire attack doesn't extend to the left. I think also if you stay like near her left, not behind her left, just near her left, I I think she will not try and hit, like, she, she will try to hit you, it's just, like, she won't do the tail swipe. Also, they also really need to decide how these collisions work. Because the collisions are really not that good when you're dodging. Sometimes you can dodge, like, through an entire group of enemies. L like, this is not a joke. Sometimes you can dodge, like, through an entire group of enemies when they're just stacked on top of you. And then other times it's just you're colliding in every single body part on the boss. God, this one sucks so much. Why are you moving like that? Yeah, I mean, look at that. She Because she's aiming in front of the player, because she's aiming in front of the player, she will literally, like, like, jump in front of you over there. Even though she has no reason to. Because, like, the player, the player is moving in one direction. She's gonna try and attack the player. Instead, she jumps in front of the player. Dodge or no dodge, she will, like, just, like, get you stuck there. Okay. Yeah, this is what I mean. She has no reason to get the player stuck. Look at this bullshit! Okay, I don't know how I was able to walk in. Yeah, this is way too much. I I I'll try locking on and simply walking inside her. Man, that is way too much. That is way too much. Like, she's... Like, I don't know why the developers never thought about people might not want to lock on and get a headache. A lot of the bosses in Cold Vein are like, you have to lock on, so you're always seeing where they go. Is this seriously the solution? Just walk inside her? Well, unless she does a tailspin, of course. Oh my god, if you're inside her, most of her hitboxes don't exist. Well, there's of course a second phase. Um. Can you just tell me what you did there? Same strategy, maybe? Well, unless she does the tail swipe, of course. I think she does the tail swipe when you're attacking. Okay. Um, okay. So... Maybe if I... I if I go diagonally in, inside her? Like, to the left diagonally? Yeah, the right, the right punishes you with everything. You have to go to the left. Stamina honestly has no place. I, I really think stamina was the one thing they shouldn't have given this, the game anything like that. Uh, 
how does why does this break my lock on? None of the other characters that teleport break my lock on. Okay, so uh god, these attacks really suck. You see, this is what I mean about consistency. All the other enemies that teleport, your lock-on stays on them. On this enemy, it doesn't. So everything I learned about locking onto enemies, it goes out of the window again. How do I know when she does the tail swipe? Is it after this? Oh no! Okay, so so first she does the, yeah this. Okay, left side again. I thought she was going to the explosion again. Yeah, I shouldn't be on her right ever. If I'm on her right, I should course correct. Okay, so the boss is not dodgeable? Uh, sorry, uh, it's not no dodge possible because of that of that attack because the problem is the lock on breaks i think the best way to think about that boss is she's gonna teleport on your sides again i killed her too fast i should have spent more time uh but i think i got the basics about the boss basically she has tracking and you have to stay inside her on her left side well on her right side on the player's left Please you just stay there make it quick shut up yakuma so you just keep on going to the I left big time for this and uh, like one swing, every time she does an attack, one swing, every time she does an attack, one swing. If you have a fast weapon, you do two swings. Um, I guess you have some kind of poise system in place. You can use a charge attack. I think that is possible for a good trade. She's actually a very easy boss. The only problem is the, yeah, like also the tail swipe. You don't activate the tail swipe. If you're, if you're, if you're not attacking and you're staying on her left side and like not around her leg part, Essentially, um, I think she won't activate her tail. I think I think that's what activates her tail. If you're like attacking, you are essentially like in position and you're like near her leg. If you're like around her torso, all of her attack miss. As long as you're pressing diagonal on the keyboard, if you're pressing diagonal to the left or if you're just pressing left, I think the rotation thing never touches you. It never did for me on keyboard, so I don't know how to work on a controller. Okay, so this boss was easy. The unfortunate part, it has quite a few bullshit attacks. It, I'm still gonna say this, it has bullshit attack and it breaks its own rules, such as breaking the teleport. Um, that kind of makes no dodge, like no dodge run impossible for it. It, it has, it has basically the two attacks in that fact, you need to dodge, that's it. Oh, also when she jumps back, you have to dodge inside you, her. You don't have an yo. option. Uh, like, uh, you, you don't have, you don't have the spacing to avoid that. Uh, otherwise, like, you can only attack anywhere. once if you're attacking Dear twice or three times. With... You know, like, like, unless you want to stay here for a year, just attacking once, that's going to be a whole different story. Oh, hey, look, a giant cat girl. Can I punish that ass? Look at this horny. Look at this. Look at this. A giant cat girl. And that armor is not available for the player. I'm okay with the horny, but man, you know, like she's tragic. She lost her life. There's a lot of sadness. And then it's like, ah, oh, yeah, look at this. Mm, latex cat girl. Who most likely also has a G spot, you know, wink, wink. You know, I can think about this. No, no, thanks. You know, that's like, that's like after someone losing their baby, telling them in a flirty way, hey, I want to make a baby. And I'm like, no, no, that's, that's not all. That's not cool, man. That just hurts people's feelings. Uh, wait, where is the, where's the tot over here and her whatever? 
A rib touch spike. Uh, by the way, I wish I could show this. This is not a joke. I wish I could show everybody this on the camera right now. This is not a joke. Right now, I'm, I have my, I have my, I have my finger pressed on on right D, the D key. I'm pressing right now right. My character is not moving. This is not a joke. I wish, I wish, I wish I had my phone like near me right now, uh, because right now I'll take a picture. I'll take a picture of my hand on my keyboard right now to show I'm pressing the D key to go to the right and my character is not going to the right if I press back she goes to the back if I go forward she goes forward but she doesn't move to the right I have to let go and now she goes right this is not a joke I swear I could if I, I swear I wish I had like those those keyboard thing icons on the screen to show what buttons I press Yeah. Oh my god, half of this stream is just cutscenes. Wow. By all means, just keep on jiggling, you giant thing. Most. Also, she really pisses me off this one, the blondie. Why doesn't she simply, like, put up her clothes? Yep. You know, just like that thing on her, on her right, uh, with, on her left arm. Just pull it up a little bit, that's all you need to do. Save yourself a whole bunch of problems, but nope, tot's got a tot. A tot can't go not totting for a totting while, can she? <laughs> oh my god, oh, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got the lore, okay, we got all these lores, oh my god, sorry for not buying an SSD drive for this I game, no oh, tot, just about. put up your clothes, woman, oh my god, that one string on your left arm, just put it up. Bitch, don't show me your underwear. I don't care about it. Is this what people get off to? Ch a, a tot with giant tits and giant ass like being like, oh, no. Look at me. I have the mental capacity of a child. Oh, I'm so innocent. Oh, is this what people get off to, man. Man, I feel I feel so weird knowing I'm such a normie. I don't need my foot stuck in a bear trap with piranhas nibbling on my testicles to get off. I'm gonna die here with all this quote unquote lore. I can Did she say I caramba? It must let's find Okay. No no Alright. Don't be coy, you little slut. Don't be like, oh no. Ooh, okay, you don't wanna be friends. Ooh, okay, ooh. So all of your like 500 most okay broadsword. How much is broadsword with her? 3,500? Huh. Venice clothes you can sell for five. I think you buy it for ten. Yeah. Okay. So I guess this is one way. I guess this is one way to like, like stock up your haze. If you don't want to lose it or something, you know, if like me, you just can't be bothered speedrunning other ways or whatever. I guess this is one way to do it. Let's say I want to sell Blood Veil. This is only 500, 5,000. Yeah. So they just, they just removed a zero. They, they really, they removed the. They don't even do like other games where you sell an item for 50% of its value. Hold on. I'm trying to find an item that has good efficiency for resell value. I got it. So 350 for all of these. 700 for the cartridges, 350 for the defenses. These things are 1,000? Are you serious? Are you pulling my balls out of my face? Oh my god, that's how bad the value of items is in this game. Oh my god, okay. So if you bought the expansion, well, not the expansion, the season pass and everything of the game, um, just go here. Depends on what you bought. If you have the, the pre-order weapons, like, uh, like you know, they're the DLC or whatever, because it costs like um, 10, 10 haze, 10 dollars, 10 XP or whatever. Just buy these. And then um, I think Venice is the easiest one. It comes with for everyone. Just buy this and like resell it for 50%. But why is this even a thing? I mean, not that haze even matters, but like, why not 50% like a normal human being? Some people are not normal, are they? That's not even a joke, by the way. If you look at the numbers, 
a weapon that gets bought for 5,000 uh, XP, you can sell it for 500. They literally just removed the zero. That's... The developers were too lazy to type in the number 2,500. Let that sink in for a minute. That's how lazy they were. A long two-handed blade mass produced by the provisional government designed for slaying large lost specimen. Yeah, let's not use guns. It is highly durable and provides the bear with a great deal of protection. Yeah, because it's a shield apparently. Feedback from Operator Queenslayer led to technological upgrades such as a single unit internally mounted eye coral conductor. I don't know what any of that means. Since that's not how this weapon works, it has nothing to do with eye core on the charge attack as far as I know. But yeah, sure, let's go with that. Is this the one? No, this is anti-body generation. I guess that's how I get my vaccines. <sighs> All this story, man, what the purpose does it serve? Yeah, okay, good for you, my god. Let me just... Why are you wearing your hat, you stupid bitch? Why are you wearing your hat? Oh, you don't dare! No, I'm pressing forward. I know we're dodging to the side. Okay, there we go. Where's the door? Is this how far the door was away from me? Oh, is the door open right now? Um, okay. Did you open the door? How? Wait, why did I remove the door? Unbelievable. Look, there used to be. Yeah, whatever, motherfucker, get out of my way! No, I'm sorry, was that six? Oh, it was six, 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 five damage. A funny number. Um, what's the red thing for? What I'm burning under the sun? I don't think our that's how vampires work, but okay. What is that red effect? What? What is that red effect? What's the point of that red effect? Who decided that red effect was needed? Oh, go away, sand! Okay, fine. Okay, I'm sorry, did that slime just explode? Oh my god, I'm gonna die from all this bloom. What? If you have a giant weapon, what do you think? Nobody would have seen that? Oh, for Pete's sake, just give me this. What the, What did I just hear? I, I mean, thank you for the speed run. What am I leaking? <laughs> Are you serious? Okay, so the slimes can go up the stairs, but those guys can't. Feet don't work. Oh, leak is to get rid of the points. Are, are you still following me, you little bitch? What, you can also fly? Okay, then. <laughs> no, okay, I can't iframe that. <laughs> Bitch, are you for real? What? I didn't know Hitler was alive and well making video games. <laughs> are, are you for real, bitch? Are you for real? Can you stop throwing your planets at me? What the fuck? What do you want, loser? Where Where is all my confetti? Well, not confetti, whatever the fuck these are called. Okay. Was this a shortcut for not a shortcut? Are you happy you got hit? Oh, of course. You do 300 damage to them, you don't have no HP. The bitch, don't you dare. Okay, you see why shotguns are dangerous? All that recoil, mmm. 
What? You finally got smart? Oh, now you got smart, bitch. Just on principle. Why is there a light source over there? Uh, okay. Glad of you to literally drop in. Ah, loser. <laughs> loser. Okay, what's with that poise? When do you develop poise? Okay, you 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 sit there and take it in the face. Little bitch ass motherfucker. I'm sorry, how small are the houses here? What are these houses? Look at the wind. What is this? This is tiny. I'm taller than one floor. What is this? An office for ants? I'm the shortest size. Uh, what? What do you want, loser? D don't buff. This is what the souls like. I'm the shortest size and I'm taller than a floor? What the f- t Wait, hold on. What? what wait, okay, wait. Whoa, what? Okay, what? Where is the floor? It's just a wall and windows. What did they sell here? Windows? It's it's a store for windows with windows and all. Hey, Toshiro! Toshiro! Yes, Miyazaki! What should we put in this building? Oh, windows. What? Windows. Why? Because that's what buildings have. Windows. Are you sure? Just windows everywhere, man. Who the fuck cares? We bought one asset, just windows everywhere. Okay, what about the floors? Where are the floors? Just put a couple of floors and that's it. We don't care about the rest of the floors. I mean, it doesn't make any sense, you know. But whatever. The foundation stayed and the floor went away. It isn't... Is that a... Is that a hole between... How does this building... I'm... How am I taller than the floors? I don't understand. I'm short. I'm like... I, I apparently Macaque is two meters by default, even on the shortest. <laughs> Bitch, was it an attack animation? I don't think so. Choose object. Check, 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 check your privilege, bitch. No. Oh my god. Oh my god, this this sand thing, man. W what is this? Do I need this? No, I don't. Oh, I can run on this sand for some reason. Are you guys? Are you? Are you kidding my balls off from my face? Can I get some stamina by the end of the day? Or is that the cardinal sin in a game, you know? God forbid you have some stamina in your video games. Dark Souls was a huge mistake in the video game industry. Look at me, I'm, I'm... Okay, these, okay, now these windows are huge in, in a very wrong way, I mean... I like how that window is going through that wall. What are these buildings? These buildings are just walls and windows, they don't know what to decide. What? Yep, that's a hitbox, alright. Yep, that's a shotgun to the face, I guess. I like how he broke his animations in the middle of his animations to complete his animations of kicking my ass animations. Oh my god, why did my character slide over there? Are you guys still after me? What the fuck is wrong with you kids? Stamina. Oh yeah, I think this is a shortcut. Ha, lose! Bitch, get out my elevator! I'm gonna paint the entire elevator red if I have to. You know, I, I think I understood why I have such a hard time with Code Vein. Well, not in terms of gameplay, I think, like, just getting my head around... Oh, right, they were leaking me. Oh, you guys dropped titanium. Oh my god, there we go, finally mastered it. 
I, I like to imagine someone out there is gonna be like, well, you mastered the shit stuff. That's not how you should play the game. You should like be using all these different buffs in different ways. Instead of going for the passives. And all I can say to them is, well, yeah. I guess, you know, apparently this game is designed around one one-shot build. Ha, huh, loser. I got your plant. I fertilized it with my blood, bitch. What are you trying to do now? An item run? Don't item run me. I item run you. Bottle jam. This... I, I, I love how none of these even make sense. Like, they're such a rarity, you know? Hey, little slut. Bitch, did you have iframes while idling? Do you seriously not get backstabbed again? Are we back to this bullshit again? God, what a load of horseshit this is! Well, what's the book for? Oh, it's a stamp icon, as if I need that! Was this like a mini boss or something? Well, whatever it is I read, does it drop anything? This is always the problem, I never know a spotless instrument. Well, does it mean, like, I don't need to be spotted by this guy? Is that the lore here? Okay. Well, yeah, I guess suicide, huh? With this item. You know, it must be nice to be a cheater. It must be so nice to be a cheater, just like your dad when he cheated on your mom. I think there's a reason also I don't like Neo because it was like, um, like the stats don't matter. Because in Neo, if I recall correctly, like you can only level up 20 times each stat, which I think lets you like pretty much, lets you pretty much play around with everything, if I recall correctly. But also the problem was, Diminishing returns were heavy after 20. There was basically no reason to like level up after 20 in each stat. Because you're getting like one... Are you for real, bitch? Do you come out here? Oh, you do. Is that st sand still? Hey, loser. There we go. Don't do the explosion. I think you do an explosion, don't you? Well, uh, okay. I killed you for no reason. You didn't even have anything. Uh, Code Vein. Code Vein. Why do you do this? If that guy drops a key, I can understand. If that guy drops something important, I can understand. But just like that. Also, you only. Like, that guy was so much more difficult. And he dropped about. I think 10k, yeah, 10k. Like 10k compared to the 4k for an easy enemy? You kill two of them, you get the same amount? What? Man, they were just going autopilot on this game. They just... They, I, I don't think anyone... I don't think anyone who was making this game actually, like, played it. A bit, because, you know, like, I'm just saying, these are not things that... Like, this is... This is not uh, rewarding gameplay. That's, that's the real thing. I really wish I didn't have to, but I did. Like, otherwise he would stunlock me and everything. Look at Tire Boy over here. I think he's doing hot shit, literally. I like how this is the one area in which the level design is actually good. The minimap is not getting you lost. The items aren't, like, in really awkward positions. Uh, but it's, like, so... And, like, you know, the shortcut goes everywhere. But, man, this level, like, comes in so, so, like, late on top of that. Like, all the other levels should have been like this. In terms of, like, you know, actual effort. You can tell this is supposed to be, like, the first starting area of the game. 
because you know it, it's your generic sand level it, it's a very cliche thing in like a lot of uh, fantasy japanese fantasy games they do this cliche of like always starting in the desert out of nothing or like in a in, the, in a more basic forest you can tell this was like the starting area and then they just they just have the brain fart because you can also tell with the bosses like a lot of bosses are way too easy and you can tell they're supposed to be like the first starting bosses uh, compared to the starting bosses what's that on the ground in front of me oh it's the particles uh so i found some information but it took me to like a youtube video and there was like a guy making a one-shot build every single person out there is just making like a one-shot build uh, like basically nobody knows how to fight half the bosses unless you go for like an sl1 video of the game sl1 or i'm sorry is this the shortcut isn't there a missile near there there better be a missile next to the boss because unless you're looking for like a SL1 run, something like this, a specific type of challenge run for the game, nobody knows how to fight the bosses. Everybody's just panic rolling, companion spamming. They're just dodging like crazy everywhere. They're using the Zwei Hunter to block like 9% of the things. Oh my God, I need to run here every time I die? From the very first bonfire? Well, not bonfire, from the very first missile? Are you serious? Wow. A lot of running for no reason. What does this add to the game other than running like an idiot here every time? That's that's how it is in Code Vein. Everybody's like too busy making one shot builds. You can basically do like 9,999 damage with... I think that's a cap damage uh, with, uh, with a machete. But of course you need to spend 5 minutes buffing before the boss. And I'm like, is this fun? Is this what gets considered for skills nowadays? Be because after I saw that video, I understood why why the Cold Vein is the way it is. Cold Vein is not is not a Souls like at all. It's basically like your um, Cold Vein is like a. Where could where could the last Harmonia be? Cold Vein is basically one of those very flashy, active. L let's say Dragon's Dogma style, whatever. Except they added the stamina bar on top of it. it uh, Code Vein was not at all designed to be a Souls-like. I don't know why they did that. Uh, because, because you know, the, like, this is just cynical. Maybe I'm just cynical, but Code Vein is, like, the example of, of something that is popular. So they're like, we're just gonna slap in the Souls mechanic on a game that doesn't, like, fulfill the mechanics. Because the entire idea behind Code Vein is go extreme on the damage, on, on the harder bosses avoid the one or two easy attacks and then slap them two times and kill them that that's the way it's designed i don't like that that's not i don't know for me that's not gameplay i i think i think one-shotting bosses should be should be like a challenge run because you can one-shot bosses in dark souls one but it requires you know a specific build a specific setup it's a real challenge you need to know the timing on the boss you need to know if you're gonna drop in or drop out how to do it stuff like that 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 is a lot different than what code vein is trying to do bitch don't eat ass like that don't your mom teach you how to ask to eat ass properly No, I just... Can I... Why do you need to stop when you want to use that item, bitch? Oh yeah, another thing I don't like about this game. Uh, it keeps on stopping you. Whenever you access a menu, it completely stops you from walking. So if I do this... Here it works. But I think if I go to another me Okay, are you making me look bad, game? Huh? So it's... A Wait, what? Oh, you can't move on the confirmation window! Oh, I see. No, I don't. Wait, but why only the confirmation window? Okay, do you just bitch slap me? How dare you? Are you leaking me? Oh my god, I need to walk all the way here? Wait, are you serious? No, there's, there has to be a much closer... 
Are you kidding me? There is only two missiles. Oh my god, the developers can go and suck a big massive... Okay. I, I, I think I might stop here today then. This is unacceptable. I, I don't know why the, uh, the developers thought this was a good idea. You can tell the developers of this game are horny. They, they don't know how to make a game because they're too busy wanking off each other in the same room. Okay, I need to stop here then for today. This is... I'm not gonna have fun here today. I'm sorry, but this is this is too much. No, this is unacceptable as a game. You can't have the... Okay. Right now, how long have I been going here? I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna count in the video. This is with me sprinter. This is me being efficient with my stamina, so to speak. Hey, Tot. Bye, Tot. A, bo a run back to a boss should never be longer than a minute. <laughs> I mean, is this supposed to be a sad moment, epic moment or something? Okay, how long do I get here? Oh, right, they shouldn't be buffing, I should just be going in. Well, calculate the buff as well. Okay, so so how, how can I do you? This will go into the ground. Okay. So you do it three times? Huh? Can you seriously not run from an attack like that? Are you kidding me? Okay, Cold Vein, this is getting excessive with your like, uh... Huh. Wow. Okay. She will just punish everything the player does. And this is not even second phase. Okay, already from the start, the boss is a... Uh, you have to dodge. The, the boss is already a dodge. You cannot afford not to dodge in this fight. This is why I keep on repeating this. This game was not built around the stamina system. And if you're gonna use stamina, you basically need to go into some weird DPS build to like one hit will like get you the maximum damage possible. So maybe first time when I complained about the, uh, the Swy Hunter being bad, Maybe it wasn't bad, necessarily, as much as you can't play it like a Souls-like. It's, it's better to use running attack, rolling attacks, stuff like that, I guess. I don't know. So far... How many bosses did I fight? Maybe seven or eight? Out of seven or eight, only two were, like, no dodge possible. The cat girl was possible, it's just, unfortunately, uh, you need to predict what she's gonna do. Which I don't think anyone can, you know, you're not clairvoyant. Look at that, look at that deja vu effect when I do this, there's like that weird slide with my character trying to correct herself. Wait, am I safe while underneath her? Oh my god, you're safe while underneath her on that attack! Well, unless she does that, of course. Oh, you bitch. Okay, if you stay, if you stay behind her, could you like... Okay, I shouldn't be getting excited about this. I won't be able to do anything today. Uh, sorry, I got excited. I... <laughs> My bad, I shouldn't get excited. Okay, so I guess on that note, 99 sleepy tight guys, have a nice week. I am outy outy outy. Uh, you, you know what? This is the perfect... Uh, th this Tomorrow will be the perfect time for me to test actually the height difference of the characters and if the hitboxes actually change. Because if I was a developer, I will just make the hitbox of the character always a 1. You know, like the height 1, that's it. Uh, taller or shorter, it wouldn't matter. Uh, but for all I know, Codebane could not be doing that. So anyways, on that note, 99 speed tight, guys. Have a nice